subtle world. It's a very nice day here. I just thought I would, you know, do something a little to be in nature. Because one of the quotes that um, I was posting about today actually speaks into nature in a, in a pretty cool way. Um, and that quote speaks to, if you truly love nature, you know, you'll find beauty in everything. And I think a lot of people try to convey a certain message um, with a certain agenda. Um, especially in what I um, I like, you know, I like environmental um, activity and concerns and a lot of people in that community are really very um, it's like their tone, you can tell they're very um, angry or motivated um, in some sort of uh, kind of um, you know they just have this vigilance about I, I, I can't explain what they're thinking because I don't know them and I just know that I just like even I just know that certain kind of people have this certain kind of general stereotypical kind of um, kind of um, taste in my mouth you know, like Westboro Baptist Church, they they have a certain kind of taste in my mouth. You know, what we have though is, you know, someone built this place. Someone um, made the roads, paved the roads for us. That's some art. That's some manual art. Someone. Um, I don't know if we're in my culture made the hospital where we could be born from, the equipment, train the doctor, where we are nature. As much as it's a challenge to know the cost of what we're doing and just being, I'm, I'm definitely concerned about the cost of what we're doing um, and being sustainable. We all we have is right now. Like, what do what is what is this um, anger? You know, what is this um, sort of kind of violent rage type um, peaceful? It's like peaceful rage, <laughs> really supporting anything uh, for people. Yeah. Well, it's, it's good to see the contrast. I will, I will say that. And I just think there's so much to live in awe for and I hope that maybe there's something for you to live in awe for. And what is that? Peace be with you.